perspective phenomenon, probably exacerbated by the curved reflective glass firmament with the stars going through the con cave mirror twisting and deforming so we need to, we need to come up with Fowler. we need to come up with something incredible to explain the the less credible phenomena that you have oh can we keep it's it simple saying that it's a moving oh, ball when we don't we need movement. a line going through the earth the plane you and you're saying that it's a ball earth? when you don't have evidence I'm of sure curvature so you're already making incredible claims that are not really founded no, they're not. Right. You, they're you don't make any sense to me. Why don't we go back to Oh, you've stolen my point now. With your movement. Unless you have that, no ball. Sorry. Look. Stop, 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 really stop. X, 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 look. This is so simple. Super duper uber simple. So, we're told two stars, two poles, two poles and stuff. So no, you observe flat. Stars. No, we observe. Yeah, no, we don't. We observe see, the pole. Yeah, we, we measure. And it the one in the south it. doesn't actually have a, like a main point. It, but, it's there's a, a star cluster called Sigma Octantis just off to the left of it, but mm -hmm. it's not an actual pole star here. The yes, north look, has the pole star. We don't. Let's start. So the explain first, that one. Let's go to the first step. Uh, egg shells. Do we see flat and stationary? Is that what we observe and no. feel? No, we don't. So do you, you're saying you see curvature and you feel motion? Yes. Yep. How do, you feel, how do you feel the Earth moving? Uh, well, when I, I lie and look at the Southern Cross, I can see everything above me, sun, moon, and stars, all moving in the same way uh, from east. To ah, east. different feeling. And so you're using your like emotions this type of feeling no, no, i can i can i can feel it but but just the same as if i put you in an office chair hold on you're confusing turned. me dude oh, no, you're no, confusing no, me no, you're you confusing me no you're confusing, me. No, you're confusing me do you say feel as in touch you can feel it with, with like your body the earth movement or do you mean you feel it as in you can sense it like a sixth sense let me answer the question okay do you want an answer yeah awesome okay so if i were put in an office chair if i put you in an office chair and i said i'm going to spin you around then you would say you would have a feeling to that is that the kind of feeling you're talking about no the earth do you feel that it's moving because of your senses like your touch your i'm your just trying spark. to establish what sense you're, sense you're talking yeah so about i'm asking which sense do you feel it like how i feel the spirit of god i feel god oh, that's, see, that's exactly right so so listen it. How do you know the earth is moving? Do you feel it? You f I asked you, I s the first point was, we don't feel the earth moving and we see flat. You said, yes, I feel the earth moving and yeah, I see yeah. curvature. Okay, let's go yeah, from yeah. there. So much like if I put somebody in an office chair mm -hmm. and I turned it mm -hmm. once per day, so yeah. it, it was a steady movement mm -hmm. rotating once per day, it's yeah. in that way that I feel it, mm -hmm. which is not really perceptible, but yes, I do feel it. I don't perceive it, but mm -hmm. I do feel it, yes. So you feel the Earth's rotation, yeah? Yes. Okay, so, so how would you want to explain to me this South Celestial Pole, the question I asked you? Can we move on to that now? No, but how are you feeling? What, what okay, mechanism? We don't have to talk about it. It's just, just we can talk about it, but what is this mechanism it. you're using? Very to... interesting, isn't it? You're like, well, we can talk about it, but what... We can talk about something it, but... a little bit parochial, like how I f what what I feel and see with my own little eyeballs. We can talk about it, but what mechanism do you like, use? I haven't, I haven't seen Greenland. You know, I haven't seen an oxygen molecule. I don't think. Mm -hmm. But there are some things that I must infer their existence mm -hmm. um, using I, using I... other heuristics, right? Okay. Um, so, for for example, I I don't feel north, but I okay. believe it to exist. Damn, you want to say something? And it does seem to does seem to point in a no. fairly reliable direction so i can go i can reason and go well lots of people have used this idea of magnetic north for many years so i can infer that it probably exists dude, despite having dude north. poetry mm. thank Gem. you no it's okay i don't i don't want to interrupt the flow it's fine i just had another example but it's irrelevant go on go on it's always interesting yeah why is it you don't want to talk about this, Kima? It seems like you're... Right, because you're topic. spiraling. I'm asking a very simple question about the motion of the Earth and do you see curvature? You said yes and yes. So I'm asking you, what mechanism are you using to feel... No, no, no. Feel... We started with a real clear question. 
we started with a super clear question, which is, can you explain the existence of a South Celestial Pole on a flat plane? Now you're trying to talk about a totally different thing because you feel you're on safer ground where, because because you'd be quite right in, in that, I don't feel like I'm flinging around at thousand kilometers an hour. It's not, in the, at least I don't perceive it. I know that I do feel it, but it's not perceptible to me. So you're no, trying to you get do on the safer it. ground, which is admittedly much safer ground, but you then have this giant celestial phenomena you need to then explain away. Mm -hmm. So we've got these two competing things and it seems like you're keen to get back onto the one that you're more comfortable in rather than being intellectually honest and stay on the one that, that is actually of, of substance to this conversation. So I just invite you to, to, to ponder on that and then maybe come back to the topic we were discussing. Just an invitation, not a demand. Okay, so that's not how this began. You said um, two poles. Again, five years ago. Okay, so this is... I think there's two, two poles, yes. Okay, so this is not how this began. I was saying there was no evidence for GLOBE. You said we have two poles. You made this claim. And then I asked mm -hmm. you... How do these two poles work on a flat plane that we observe and that we don't feel moving? Then you said you observe curvature and you feel the earth turning. Then I asked you, what's the mechanism you're using to detect this motion? Right. So it seems I, I see. Well, so what you're saying is if I do not experience, if I'm not perceiving a spinning um, ball uh, and I'm not observing perceptibly the curve, then how can I explain this phenomenon that seems to argue with those? No, I didn't say any of that. No? Okay. Okay. I'm trying to rephrase it to make sure I understand your right. question. You so claimed for you. the evidence for a globe is two poles. Yeah? Some evidence for it, sure, yeah. That's the evidence for a globe. And I said, we don't observe a globe. We don't feel motion. You and I both observe a flat plane and we observe, uh, we feel no motion okay right so yeah i think it's inferred ahead. it's inferred because he can only think of a globe making that phenomena possible but the faraday effect can twist light by magnetic fields go ahead show us. Show us. Deep magnetic ahead. Show fields us. you have the light twisting in some way giving you these pole stars so that that would be an interesting explanation. I would like to see that because I've heard that one before. It's similar to having like a personal dome. Is that what it's talking about? The main um, takeaways that I've seen for alternatives to this ball is perspective, a concave punched in mirror, basically flipping the image, a oh, glass yeah. dome, a personal oh, yeah. dome, Faraday effect, that sort of thing. So, right, okay, I'm Googling it now. The magneto-optic Faraday effect. Okay, interesting. So, yeah, that could be an explanation for it. Is that is that the one you want to go with? Then can, I'm going to go with a concave punched-in mirror because it'll flip and invert the image. If you have a punched-in mirror and you take um, uh, an image past the focal point, it'll flip. So if you have a revolving star trail over a flat plane, potentially that star trail could flip, invert, and give you a circle. But who knows? Right. Sure. So that could explain it. It would. What it would struggle to do, though, is um, explain uh, why it's totally different constellations. So we have reliable constellations in the south that are different to the north, which is why they appear on flags. So if it was just a flipped image, you would expect that that we would just see Polaris, but in the south, Solaris, maybe we'd call it. I don't know. And we'd see all of the same celestial bodies that you see in the north would just see them flipped in the south there's so there's one problem with it second problem would be you would get you get an effect right as you get to the edge of something because we've got this clockwise in the south counterclockwise in the north oh yeah is he going to be able to come here the lemon you oh, get you're letting him get away with the presuppositions okay if we start at the point where we observe flat which i expect you to say no you see curvature so we can go from how do you know it's curving you obviously made a measurement you've established horizontal that's where we should start from so until you've done that you have to explain how these two poles work on a flat plane that we observe you appear to get antipodal um i'm sorry a north and a south star trail with that video i put in the chat with the personal no, we don't have star trail in the sky demon we have stars Trails, nice one, Lemon. That's a good one. Yeah, so that's how we explain yeah. it on a flat plane. No, no, um, no eggs. We, we have, have trails. Oh, we don't. 
Sun came out, we don't have star trails in the sky, we have stars. And now I want to do to see it, do it, you do it with stars. The no, star no, we've got an explanation. All right. All, right. All right, I'm back. And this is, around this, around is, point. this is a really interesting thing, this idea that there is a flipped concave mirror, because then what we would be in, infer, um, invoking is two separate explanations for two nearly identical phenomena. Just right, an explanation, one... dude. It's not. There's no demonstration. We're just trying to guess what's yeah, going it's on. Yeah, interesting. Is there's no demonstration. There's no measurement here. We're just, just guessing, sort of right? You're guessing yeah. that they're opposite one another. We're guessing they're all above us. I can't go with this globe explanation because the star trails are not antipodal with an eight thousand mile um, uh, axis going from the north to the south through the curved Earth. So I can't go with that. At best, it would be some sort of visual perspective optical phenomenon. Right, but, over we, but, I've, but I've explained there are, there are multiple pr problems with the idea of it just being a flipped image. In that, like the, the other thing that you guys really miss out on in the northern hemisphere. I'm sorry to let any of you mm -hmm. northerners know. This, what are we missing out on? You go don't on. get the. You, you don't get the um milky way like when you get stars at night it's like oh look lots of bright things we get this giant bright beautiful just absolutely gobsmacking smear across the sky which is just so much so much cooler than, mm -hmm. than what you get in the northern hemisphere wow here, along with um amazing Southern cross What's so it doesn't on? appear to be a flipped image it appears to be a different totally different thing that's still like the sun and the moon goes east to west, rises and sets. <sighs> well, we have the rainbow, which appears to be a lateral circle going left and right, suspended above the ground. And if you get close enough to the ground, it turns into an arch that goes above and below the horizon. This uh, lateral circle could be akin to the sun, moon, and stars in their revolution over the flat plain, which looks like an Kinder. arch from being too close to the ground over the flat plain. So perspective appears to be doing some very interesting things. It's optics. Yeah, What's this so, thing yeah, about the, the, here's, the here's celestial the poles the... not being antipodal, Lemon? Uh, so they had again, to do with them not being an exact same. thousand mile line from the north celestial pole to the southern celestial pole going through the axis of the earth straight through the diameter until we have that these stars don't really prove much of anything but what do you mean a line what what do you mean do you mean somebody should drive a big pole through the earth and until imaginary then... axis yes if we're not seeing well, what do you that, mean then we don't have anti total star I don't know what you mean. How, do, how would we, in, in reality, in practicality, how would we go about providing this piece of evidence that you say is missing? What do we actually have to do? Least, we would need to see a southern star trail that is below the horizon with an 8,000 mile line going from the northern star trail to the southern one with an anti-podal axis. Uh, we don't we, appear to no, that. no, uh, Lemon, you've gone off into, into fantasy land again. In, this is the question. In, what do I do? What tools do I go and get? What materials do I get? What, how do I make this line? That's your ball. Get on it. <laughs> no, it, no it's, it's your requirement of evidence. Your, spe it's, your specific sure requirement that you're way. giving let, me. Let me you know, what, what does it mean? Requirement I'm sure is you'll like find a way to fake the ball. I'm yeah, sure you'll sure find it. See, look. Sure. No, so I that... posted it. There it is. I've just posted it in the, in the so chat. So he needs a, piece, a specific piece of evidence, but he isn't prepared to tell me what that's proceeding. I'm not saying that it's a ball. This is what I would need to see to even begin to believe the ball. Oh, right. Okay. Right. So things that are evidence of it being spherical and that are impossible on any other shape should be disregarded until we've already established in some other way that it's spherical. That's only evidence so, if it's tied to the shape so, of the so, land. So you could apply need to that go to the southern pole and see a zone of revolving polar stars above our head. I haven't seen this provided uh, by anybody. You could apply and, this so to so all evidence, so though, and infer like, that it's over the pole, but nobody's gone to the pole to prove this in the north or the south. Yeah, I'd go with the it. north, but the south, no. Okay, so you do know that it's there in the north. That's useful. Yeah, people have talked about uh, Polaris right. being northern pole star for centuries. The okay, southern one appears edge. to be the new kid on the block. Well, well it's not. New. That's why I was How showing new you does it flags. appear to be, Lemon? 
Uh, I think they discovered Sigma Octanus, what, in the 17th century? I say it's not that new then. 300 years. 200, uh, yeah, 300 years ago. So I'll, I'll actually just make it easier for you. I'll grab it as a GIF out of this video showing this, this counter rotation in the Southern Hemisphere. How's that sound? Nobody disagrees that there's a counter rotation. They're wondering if it's a perspective or optical well, phenomenon. Well, Chemo does. He, he like denies that there's even a, a celestial confused. pole. Chemo, you deny that there's a celestial pole at all? No, no, yes. we've, got, we've got the northern one, yeah. I think the true one's the one in the north, the fake one's the one in the south. If you walk up to it, like the train tracks do to perspective, it will open up like a book. And before you know it, it will change shape due to perspective and optics. That's You're what I crazy. suspect. Oh, just a How thinker, an independent thinker. We have one Who's star lemon, and all, all, all the other stars you know revolve around the North Star you know. lemon, right? Lemon, lemon. How, how we go about uh, uh, finding which one is fake and which one is real? We'd have to walk nice up to it as much as possible. Ideally, get right under the sucker. Why would you need to be under the South one, but it sounds you were quite comfortable with the North one just existing without need, requiring the same burden on it? Uh, obviously, we'd need to test both of them, but the north one has been around for thousands of years, while the so southern one has been a little bit suspect. I think it's a billion years. I think it's a few billion years, buddy. It doesn't make sense uh, because you're near the edge. That's why we can't visualize this star underneath us. Yeah, it sounds like you, you're going according to the... that. What that sounds like to me, Kimo, is fascinating because what that sounds like you're saying is that doesn't work. I'll tell you how you can prove it. We put this forward a couple of years back. If you can get three observers in the South, uh, uh, South Africa, Australia, and South America uh, to see this star at the same time, this would prove it. So Isn't the it? fact that I put them, I just posted, I'll, I'll give you the flag. No, no, no. What we put forward was you would need three people on the phone at the same time. You know, stop lying, man. It doesn't become you. Yeah, he wasn't you, around. You know, did you did he you was, have that verification for the Northern Hemisphere stars? He wasn't around when we put this forward, Scott. This was many years you back. Would just you would just reject it, too. Yeah, but he wasn't around when we put this forward. We so, said, get three you know, observers. You deny that I flew south, east, south, I'm happy to do that experiment. You deny anything. Yeah, but he wasn't I'm around back then, that. Scott, when we asked to do this, right? Chemo? And it was going to be done. Ballers said they were going to do it. It was never done. Yeah, I'm happy to do that. Um, in fact, I've already I've already been uh, over the last few weeks um, trying to find um, flat earthers who live in the south. No, hemisphere. get a ball earther. Get two ball earthers with fine, you. It's fine, it's fine. But I just just for the sake of this conversation, mm. one thing that I think is compelling is that we've got it on. I think it's Tonga, Fiji, Brazil, New Zealand, and Australia all have the same constellation. On yeah, it. but so what we're asking for, try to listen, get three observers at the same time to look at this star at the same time, and that will confirm yeah. that there is a southern hemisphere and there is a, okay. uh, a star opposite to the northern star or pole. Not a star, not a star opposite pole, to it. Pole, 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 yeah. yes. Yeah, yeah. So, okay, that's really interesting. So if I showed that to you, yeah. you would agree give that up the flat earth. Hemisphere. I'll give up the flat earth immediately, and I will no, go uh, globe. No, find a reason to, I will to go globe. And go, no, no, I don't believe that because I wasn't there. I will go globe smacking so, and globe smack okay. the, uh, the life out of all the flat earthers. Shit. Yes. Okay, so let's put this in text so we can agree on it. Yeah, write it down, record it, writing. clip it, do whatever you need if, to do. If... Sure. If riding on eggshells, mm -hmm. there's three observers and, at the same yeah. time in the South, South three. Africa, South America, and Australia, looking at this uh, pole uh, no. at the same time. All this of the, is, the you're on know, the this phone. Has been done. You're on the no, phone. No, no, hey guys. Already, hey guys. This is me. Been done. Chemo. This is me. Hey guys. No, look no, no, at me. It's already I can been see. done. You've been shown the evidence of it. Hey and you guys. Continue to ignore it. No, no, it's been done. This is new with me though. Hey guys. This is me. Yeah, you just be like, look, we're all together at the same time. We're all looking at the same uh, pole at the same time. Bang, flat Earth is over. Oh, wow. Okay. That's just good, like good. that. That's really impressive. Just like that. that. Ke Overnight. Chemo will, chemo will how, how, would you, how would you state what, how you would change your views? What do you mean? It's a globe. Bang, you've got a southern you, hemisphere. You believe it's a globe. Not believe. We will have saying. the evidence. We will know you've got three yeah. observers yeah. in the south the... looking at this uh, point. 
Okay, excellent. And so then all of the gas stuff about gas stuff about water, it all works. You would go, well, it all works because it all works, all works. Okay. because well, listen up. Disagrees with you. Listen up. Excellent. Oh, By the time I, you I do, listen up, listen up, listen up, listen up, listen up, listen up. So this again, you will also be famous because this has never been done. So you and Bio, the new Globe Earthers, will get notoriety for conducting an experiment that's never been done before. So yes, we will have gravity. Oh. We will have gravity through BioDuel. And we will have no, the observation. No, we have gravity regardless of me. Oh, sure. But right now, we don't have the experiment. And then of you, Air uh, Riding. We do have the experiment. Eggshells, remember, write it down, clip it. All you need to do, you said you're going to get three right. observations. Listen, what's the time and date? It's now quarter to one. Cool. Look at the date. We already know. Look at the date. The date is 20th of February. Yeah, We're in February in chat. 2021. You said. 21st here. You said. Dude, you said. Don't do it. Don't you said you're gonna no. He said it already. He's already said it. He said he's gonna get three observers in this uh, same time, looking at the same point. Now you remember you said that. There we go. Okay. There you go. And then, Kimo, what's to keep you from joining Lem and, and all the other flat earthers in their chant of magic mirror reflection? Don't be silly. Yeah. How can that be? We've got three observers at the same time, looking at the same point. That doesn't work on a flat plane. Magic mirror reflection. You'll it be doesn't unmoored. work on a flat plane. Kima, when when did you do this for the northern hemisphere? Because it seems like you don't have a problem with the northern one. So this exact um, setup, when when was this done for the northern hemisphere? On a flat earth, it works. No, no, no. Again, you're setting a standard for the southern hemisphere. I'm just wondering um, what standard is Look, uh, listen to you. The you've already got your task. Provide mass attractive mass. No, now, I'm sorry. It's not about me, Kimo. I'm asking right. a simple question. Yeah, so stop changing the topic. No, I'm not changing the topic. I'm exactly... I'm no, talking about exactly... You want to talk about mass attractive mass so again? again. The, the standard that you have there for the southern hemisphere, yeah. have you applied that standard to the yeah. northern hemisphere Yeah, at all when yet? you provide your experiment, we can talk. Stop changing the topic. But right now, we're talking about this but guy what, riding what on eggshells. What topic am I changing up? Riding on eggshells. Kimo, he, Kimo mm -hmm, mm -hmm. he's not changing the topic. Mm -hmm. He's specifically talking about the celestial poles no he's so asking what, me what you play he's asking me if i've done something we're talking about his this guy's right. claim i'm not asking if you right. did something Kim. Right, i'm asking you it, you have a standard for the southern hemisphere do you up do you apply that standard to the northern hemisphere right there's, there's nothing wrong with that What's and my answer mean? was that we have on the flat earth it works Right, but that isn't an answer. That's an answer to a completely different question no, that we didn't ask. No, because on a flat earth, the southern one doesn't work. Well, that's a great concession yeah. that you're making. Doesn't work. So if he can show three observers, the flat earth is... Look, if it doesn't work, if you can show it... Go on. Sure, and one of the things that, that is quite important is, um, mm -hmm. is that we'd be able to get three people at night time. So I might... Um, oh, problems, so problem. look, look, problems already. Your claim was no, you can have I'm three still observers. Happy still happy to do it? Look, three observers. I don't want to hear the excuses. Just like Boyo started to think about it. Oh, actually, 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 you made no, the I don't claim. have an actually. You got actually, actually, just excuses, could... excuses. I don't hear them excuses. You said I can so, get three I'm observers. Just asking a question, Kimo. Look, I don't want to hear the excuses. Is, would, 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 you be, would you be happy if they were shifting the goalposts? The goalposts they be shifting. They be shifting the goalposts. Yes, exactly. Australia, South Africa, and one of the um, Polynesian islands, Look. or somewhere else. So we've got night all at the same time. So it's you change, observers. change the deal now. You want to change it now, yeah? No, well, you don't change it. We're thinking about reality here, Kimo. We're still saying three observers. We're still saying three observers separated um, across a, a great span of what what you believe to be a flat plane, showing the same phenomena in the sky. It's just we have to get three at you night. Don't get so boastful when you're around the flat earthers because now you're changing what you said. I said South America, South Africa, and Australia. You, you asked said for something. You dishonestly asked for something that you knew wasn't possible. No, no, we can still, we can still do it. He can, can still, still do it. He can still, still do it. Stars. He can still do it, Jem. Remember, Jem, he's I'm making the claim. All right. And I know you want to protect you guys. Dude, you... dude, <laughs> it's not possible. It's not uh, possible. No, 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 Jem. I think it is. Jem, please let me finish. Something. Let me finish. Go ahead. Can't what do this to me. Kimo, oh. let me finish. <sighs> what he's demanding is not possible, probably. Why? It's because the same issue. Not, because they're not all going to be in darkness at the same time. Right. Now, it's, it's the same okay, issue in the right? northern hemisphere. 
it's, Appar- it's apparently a, they can be if you go to timeanddate.com and check the thing but i think that's it. true yeah i think that's true yeah but you, you you're gonna have to pick the locations and the times cap yeah that's, think, that's but, all i was that's all i was asking if we can just if but, we can just agree to choose places that are in darkness at the same time right but he, but then you are changing it and he's gonna say oh well you changed it yeah well that's why i'm that's why i'm hoping that chemo would be reasonable and Go on time of the com, you could get all the content. Now. It's too late now. Not Jen, Jen just got involved. I think, it's ridi- I think it's ridiculous. I think what, what I said at the start, it stands. I think that to deny something which is just so known is absurd, and to require this idiotic standard of evidence, which is, but as Bio has pointed out, you didn't require for the northern hemisphere. It's, it's because there's no contention about the norm. And it's just, it's just making people jump through hoops for no, no reason whatsoever. There's no contention about the South either. There is contention about oh, the South. No, yeah, there, there is no claim. No, there's there isn't, there isn't any contention at all. Don't talk just nonsense. you guys and you're nobody. That's contention. And here's the other thing. Uh, just just idiots who just him. need it to be true. And if people but, were but to pull this stuff in, yeah, Chemo's going to turn around and say, oh, I still wasn't there. Therefore, I don't believe the observations you've got. They're CGI or manipulated in some way. He'll find all some right, excuse all right. Make to get out. After, after you provide your substantiation. We don't need any excuses for something that's obvious and can, can be seen by billions of people. Do we? Okay, so look. Yeah, you do, actually. Because okay. you're making a positive claim. No, we don't. No, we don't. No, no. All right, let you me just make that. Can, can I just fight? You need excuses for why you you're pretending. You need excuses for why you're pretending that this this thing that anyone can see doesn't exist. All right, let's just, let, let's just wrap it up quickly. Because consensus. remember, oh. remember, when we've argued about your standards of evidence before, we, we've come down to things like, well, everybody needs to be able to do it. If everyone can go and see it, then I'll accept it to be true without actually going to see it I never said that. I said myself. independently verifiable. So anyone going to those three locations at that right, at the correct time should be able to see these, right? These three right. observers should be able to right. show, that, show that. Right. So the, yes. All right. Yes. So you guys make the positive claim that this is possible, yeah. that this is it's what we observe. One. So show it. Sure. So yeah, all I'm just establishing is: no. Would we be comfortable with no. South South? Yeah. <laughs> Hang on. Yes, Jim. Jim. Oh, said it. Right. Said no, it, you Jim. No, you said it. Not. No, you have <laughs> not. No, we don't show it. And and how have you flipped the standard there? Like I said before, you're, when I've argued with you about the existence of China, we've got down to well, if loads of people can go there, I'm happy to accept it. Or I don't actually need to go there myself. I just need to be able to go there. I need it needs to be freely available to me. And this is available to you. So why are you denying it? It's First ridiculous. off, you need three people to do this, and now no, you're shit, no, trying you to shit the no, burn of... Hold up, no, hold up. You're no, trying to shit stop. the burn of... Listen, you what? were talking. Let me talk. Okay, but you're, why you're do I need to three shit people? The burn of proof to why me, do I need okay? three people? Where's that? Where's that's that your idea claim, that you guys need three observers. No, you, you can no, show us with three observers in those is, three locations. My claim is that there's a sudden celestial pole. That's it. No, I'm not talking about you. I'm talking about the other guy. Okay, if you no, guys are team. It doesn't matter. The claim is that there's a sudden celestial pole. The claim is that from those three locations on those three continents at the right... Time, it, it's, it, you can it, see the it's South ridiculous. Celestial Pole and my, from, look, from different, look, like, from the same not, direction. Look, we're not talking about what he's setting up, his observation. It's irrelevant. My point is, it's entirely unreasonable that he needs to do this. And you guys it's know it. It's entirely unreasonable to substantiate your positive No, place. it isn't. Okay. It's, this is, it's like saying... You're a true intellectual... Listen, guy. idiot. It's like saying, Australia doesn't exist. Prove it to me. I'm not going to believe Australia exists until eight people from uh, <laughs> argumentum from ad six absurdum. Sistic, your, your argument is absurd. No, yes, argumentum ad yes. absurdum. Because we've already, like, Australia is independently verifiable. It's something the, that the no one's contending. Pole is it's a false analogy because ver- no one's contending the that whatsoever. The Southern Celestial okay? Pole is independently verifiable. Okay, then, sh- then it show, that it's, show the verification. Explain if this is true. Me. If Explain this is true, me. show the show the evidence. No, for it. no, 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 I'm not yeah. showing anything. All right. Explain to All me right, how explain to me how Australia is independently verifiable, yeah. whatever the fuck that means, and the Southern Celestial Pole is not independently verifiable. Whatever Anyone the fuck that, that means. 
Okay, anyone that can wants to go to Australia can go to Australia, right? If they have right. Buy right. Tickets, they anyone Australia. that wants to see the tons of us, tons of us know people that live in Australia or have visited Australia. We've seen images and videos, you know, credible videos and stuff, live streams stuff from Australia. So yeah, you're so supposed to be telling me things that aren't beyond true reasonable doubt. It's proven pole. to exist beyond reasonable doubt. Now you guys are claiming that the South Celestial Pole is visible from all three continents. Um, right. It, right. Uh, stop. On the stop. Flags. Stop. My claim is not that it's visible from all three continents. Now, you were supposed to Fine, not you, but the other dude that's visible from Again, all three continents at the same time me. at night. You are talking to me. Fuck I'm wait. talking to you guys, you globs. You are talking okay? to me at the moment. No, I'm talking to all of you. Now, hey, you were supposed to be... You were, <laughs> the, the, my question was, you were supposed to be explaining to me what what how Australia is independently verifiable and the Southern Celestial Pole is not independently verifiable. Did All I claim the it wasn't independently Listen, verifiable? Stop! Stop! I'm still No, no, no. Talking. Did I claim the Southern Celestial Pole, seeing it from three locations, is not independently verifiable? Did I claim Right, I've had to mute you, okay? <laughs> Again, we are not talking about three locations. I'm not talking about that. You're talking to me. I am not talking about three locations. I'm talking about the existence of a Southern Celestial Pole only. Now, you were supposed to be telling me, y your claim was that Australia is independently very viable, but a Southern Celestial Pole isn't. Then you listed the, the reasons why Australia is, is independently vi verifiable. All of the reasons you provided also apply to the Southern Celestial Pole. All of them. So do you have any reason to not believe there's a Southern Celestial Pole and to believe there is an Australia? Go ahead. Why are you inserting yourself in a conversation and trying to hijack the topic uh, to something else? No. Okay? The claim was I, that, we're, that you can observe this from three locations at the same time. I was, I was in the conversation right at the start. No one's talking I about made, whether or not we observe I made a, a point, Southern Celestial Pole. I made a point right at the start. I realize it's drifted off. But I want to reassert my point because I I'm think pretty sure no one's contending that we observe a celestial pole. Hi, listen. The claim is, is that you observe it from three locations at the same time. Is why is there's, that there's required if it's a southern celestial pole? Can I say something? Go ahead, bro. Go ahead. I'm sure it'll be completely irrelevant. All right, we all, it, I'm, Jim. You know, I, we understand. <laughs> that you can't see it with your human eyes, and that's going to be all right, man. And you can't yes, take you a picture. Can. Yes, you no, can you... see it with your no, human you... eyes. Oh, yes, no, you can. Oh, no, no what did? It... Oh, I forgot. You're right. You can you can supposedly see it with your human eyes, but it cannot be photographed. That's that's no, it's it. It's been photographed. I've put a I've put a in the shit chat. Too, guys. No, it's never never been photographed. Thank you very much. I'll let, I this will let you get back to it. Photographed and <laughs> videographed. It's been <laughs> videoed as well. It's just ridiculous. ridiculous. The point yeah. is, the point yeah. is, yeah. 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 you have to jump through the these hoops to establish something that's been established for hundreds of years that everybody knows to be true. And, and it, Stop it's straw manning. ridiculous. I'm you're not straw manning and it's anything. A, it's, a, it's pathetic, Jim, because you keep on trying to make okay, it about the existence the of the South Celestial Pole. What was the no, one's, no one's saying that this thing isn't observed. Okay. Timo is we're absolutely saying, fake. Listen, we're saying idiot. that this claim where it's observed at the... Listen, idiot. I know you've joined this halfway through. Chemo right. is absolutely saying that this isn't observed. Absolutely. I have compassion for y'all, okay? It's going to be all right. Anyways, the conversation was about the claim that it's observed from three different continents at the same time. Yeah. Okay? And, Jem, Jem if I can respond to what you were saying, I... I, I agree that it is somewhat redundant to do something that mariners have done for hundreds and hundreds of years that was so verifiable that they put it on flags so they it, like the flag was basically a street a, a ocean map to tell them how to get there um the the reason i'm curious to do it is because i am fascinated by how people um can protect cherished beliefs and so what i absolutely expect to happen is exactly what all you all of you are saying is that i will be able to produce this phenomena and then there will be a different reason to discount it but that that's what i'm fascinated by what worry about that later reason. first produce the yeah. the yeah, yeah, second yeah. the proof second. Reason, the about. reason i butted in is because i think you're already in that reason to be discounted already yes that's why i'm that's why i'm trying to trying to accept from um from uh 
uh, chemo that that he'd be happy if it was just sufficiently spread out across because we definitely have night time at the same time South Africa and Australia. If I if you know if it's the start of night time, sorry, the just you know last thing early morning here, and then just as the sun's setting there, and then if we picked somewhere else in the middle like one of those islands or potentially even New Zealand might stretch to New Zealand, would he still accept that? Dude, you go I, time, I on day do, time and day.com, you could have night from all three continents, yeah. South America, Percentage. Australia, Percentage. and Africa. Percentage. Hold on. And let me put the word in. Go How about we, we, we replace the, the requirement for three people at the same time for one person for 24 hours? How about that? What would, how would that be better? No, I think three people. Because if a person see it for 24 hours, then it's there for 24 hours. No, it doesn't disappear for, for one hour or three hours it moves or anything. It's there for 24 hours. How far south are you going, man? Well, how yeah, would I mean, that affect anything? That no one's claiming together. that. It disappears. The stars don't just guess. suddenly disappear. You can guess how far I need to go. Yeah, and it has to be in their winter, right? They, they would have to disappear on a flat Earth. Um, any, right. any depiction or model of a flat Earth shows Australia and South America. Essentially, both looking south are looking in opposite um, directions. So I you would have to have stars and constellations disappear right, from we one. Under, we understand yeah, that, your, that your brain on a flat plane. Hold on, hold on. We understand that you guys are brainwashed with your globe Earth map and believe what you're being told on it. But what we're telling you is it's not where where they say it is. All right. How hard no. how much how much more do you want me to, to say it? The map is wrong. Okay? You can tell say me, whatever you so want, tell David. Me, it works. By the way, so David, tell me how how can one person on the edge of the disc can see the space, same star rotating above them for twenty-four hours? You're not what well, you're not seeing the southern celestial pole. All that you're seeing is the southern cross. So quit telling that story. No, no, no you see the southern there, sky. You're not southern seeing, sky. You you are not the, seeing. The, and I challenge you. I yeah, but the, the pole, video. David. The pole is a point in the sky. Yeah, it's All right, an David. David, we'll David I posted it twenty-four hours. All right, twenty-four thanks. hours of the the south celestial pole pictured. Film from the South Pole. Now I challenge you to find me the same from the North Pole. Right, that's a slightly different thing. So if somebody wants to take up that challenge, that's fine. I'm just curious to hear from Chemo about what he thinks about going South Africa, Australia, and then somewhere else that's also in nighttime. Come on, let's yeah. go for. Who's got? Who's got? Hang on, David. Grand. Hang on, David. Oh, let's hear from Chemo, please. Go ahead, Chemo, because I did hijack that a bit i guess he went to make tea or something or is he gone there's no <laughs> amount of evidence that would ever convince them uh, uh, i'd like to go back to what oh, dave said before about the map hang on, being hang, on wrong. hang on then let's get yeah yeah, yeah i'll just say this, this is something that's been around for a long time many 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 years so if he can show the three observers at the exact same time and they're talking to one another they're making the same observation flat earth is there uh, done and dusted done and dusted sure so you're happy with three su sufficiently separated locations that one doesn't have to be in south america and in daytime oh so you're changing that because you do i did say south america yeah, so, we did say australia yeah, so the, and we said uh, south africa yeah so happy with south africa and australia um but obviously with it being pretty much 12 hours apart like 10 hours apart it won't be possible in south um america then, didn't you say so the choice... there's night at the same time in all three continents i think there is night, it's not it night is, yeah. at the same three time they're pretty pretty much according to the globe model pretty much diametrically opposed so they they do not share any night time so would you be happy with somewhere that according was according to timeanddate.com if they they can have night on the coast uh, in all three continents yeah so you got to get someone in the right places in the right position at the same time that, that's what he's clearing up right now with you that's what i'm yeah that's what i'm clear clearing well, we've up. just told you, you there's night in these places so you have to get the people who live in these well, places that's, that's not what i'm finding can the person who found that um found that there's night time in the same place because i just checked and i get 10 p.m oh, just, just give a screenshot for starting or something in, in, i don't know just show them um, sure, give me, i'm give getting me a minute midday in um in uh, south america 
All right, all right. Yeah, it would be like astronomical twilight or something, but it wouldn't be civil twilight. You should be able to still see stars. Anyways, I'll I'll pull up a screenshot. The the three points aren't in darkness at the same time. At the same time. Oh, well, they're not. Yes, you you can you can have it. Perth, South Africa. No, you can't. What's the deal here? What's the deal? Do you even know your own? Got to get them without cloud and. uh... You'd have to do it in winter then, I suppose just a nightmare that you're setting up for yourself here and uh, and um, for what to establish say... something that's <laughs> as established as the existence of australia no jeb this is something that will end the flat earth overnight overnight no it won't it won't yes it will because it, 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 it exists already, already with mountains of evidence to support it and mm. you still deny it. So the, the the science for me is not so much about physics or the globe. The science for me is much more about um psychology. Kim, uh, Kimo, even on a flat Earth, the um the three continents that that you specified, even on a flat Earth, they won't all experience uh sunlight or night um all at the same time. So so it doesn't matter what um presupposition we have or what we're testing, um it it wouldn't be possible on any model. So that's why he's trying to clarify what three locations do experience nighttime and would you accept those specific locations? Here's how you really do it is you get it in writing and everybody puts up a thousand dollars and leaves it with a lawyer. Well, that's one way to do it. Not being uh, the, the, guys, uh, the guys here are prepared. These guys, um, we've got Bio, he's about to do a vacuum experiment. We've got um, Eggshell. I don't know why you're changing the subject, Emo. We're not changing. We've got Eggshell here. He's about to do um, an observation with three observers in the south. I'm going to end flat Earth overnight. It there. appears that um, we can't see the stars at the same time along um, all of the uh, lines of latitude. Um, proof 100 from Eric DeBase, 200 proofs the Earth is in a spinning ball, says, if Earth were a ball, the Southern Cross and other Southern constellations would all be visible at the same time from every longitude on the same latitude, as is the case in the North with Polaris and its surrounding constellations. Oh, Earth, the major, minor, and many others can be seen from every north than Meridian simultaneously. Lemon, I want you to really think about this. Constellations like the Southern Cross cannot. This proves that the Southern Hemisphere is not turned over as in the Ball Earth model, but simply stretching further outwards away from the Northern Center Point as in the Flat Earth model. Lemon, I want you to really think about the differences, what you're talking about here. You're talking about a center point of rotation and a constellation that is away from that center point. And you're trying to equate them as if they're the same thing. Why is Derek Dubé the source of truth on anything? Like so that? that implies that the land is expanding further outward toward the south. And with local requirements and local perspectives, you see the constellations temporarily before they turn up and under the horizon due to perspective, curved glass dome or whatever. Due to the curved earth they do this the constellations do this but when you're in the northern hemisphere you'll be able to see the northern pole because that is its center of rotation but on that same note in the northern hemisphere not you won't be able to see um orion's belt for example at particular uh or all at the same time in the northern hemisphere because it's a constellation away from the center point is there a southern pole of rotation? A not a star but there is a pole yeah, um, do all the flat earthers here agree that there's a southern point of rotation? No, that's that's the whole point we did, we've been discussing. I would well, say so that now. it's, I would say it's due to perspective. But if you walk up to the southern quote unquote pole, it'll open up due to perspective, like the train tracks open up and appear to be under your feet when you walk to the train tracks at the horizon. Right, that's a hell of a claim. Different, different phenomena and different claims. So I'm just yeah. really, really keen to just get to the end of this point, and then I'll shut. They'll up. never, oh, they'll never yeah. accept I, it. I mean, just like, just mm-hmm. like we've never so seen. It would be a good piece. Of, it would be a good piece of evidence to have, though. So I think I, it's should, just like we've know, never seen know, anybody wanna... fly. We've never seen anybody fly under the North Pole star, and we've never seen anybody fly under your southern supposed southern. Uh, you the can't accept star. the ball because it goes against my sense neither, and reason. Guys, neither guys, neither guys star, please let eggshells get there. through this. Please. No, neither no, star has just, been verified. Just Nobody so close to tell us. Underneath. Absolutely keen to hear that. If I could just get to the end of this with Chemo, and then, and then I can sort of open the floor and yield the floor to everybody else. Um, Chemo, would you be happy to accept South Africa, Australia, and another point in between them?
You mute it, Kimo, if you don't know. Uh, where are we now? Question is, would you be happy to accept South Africa, Australia, and somewhere in between them? Well, percent's just shown a map of where darkness lies. So I think where yes. we asked is possible, right? South America, South Africa, and Australia. Well, yes, well South, South, South America is going to be going to from below the equator is going to be in um, dusk there, and Sydney is going to be in um, you know well into its morning there. So if we shift that across and go, we can easily get South Africa and Sydney in at the same time. Then we've got a chunk of islands in. Show us the them, map. Let's have a look at the map. Sorry. Let's see how it looks on the flat yeah, Earth map. You've got to show me, uh, you got to show me, because the, the problem is, it yeah, must, listen, listen, Earth map, listen, 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 awesome. listen, listen. If it works on a flat Earth map, <clears throat> then there's no point doing it. If it doesn't work, then you've got to show me it doesn't work on a flat Earth map. Right. Kimo, guess what? Guess what? That, that picture that percentage posted is based off the globe earth i know but what i'm saying yes. is is that if because right. what we're well, saying is or what i'm saying is, is yeah, that I think it's a reasonable i think it's a reasonable thing to check he's got to check that it does that you wouldn't get the same phenomena if it were a flat on a flat earth yeah so just if you just want to pull up a flat earth map or put it in the chat then we can um there are the none and then have that yeah, there are none Kimo, I think, I think. I, yeah, but I what we're saying is, we, we don't have a map. But what we're trying to show you is, is that if you're in the south, if you're in the south, because it's a flat plane, it, it, you cannot have this observation. You're looking in the opposite direction. You're not, you're not looking at, in the same way, basically, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So do you want so to how much... get, a, get a flat Earth map and sl slap it in the chat so we can then? So we well, can again, it's not like we have a map. We just have, a, you know, projection ideas. Yeah, like, so signatures and money. Projection in the chat. Oh, yeah, I'm not, I'm yeah not let me get you on I mean, those. I'll, I'll happily take it. But... but that's the only thing that will motivate them to be even close to honest. So there we go. So see, what I'd be looking at is from Australia, which is at about uh, sort of 1030 on that map, looking north um, west, if you will, if we're looking north as the top of the map. Um, and then South Africa would be looking... Um, East, pretty You're much. all going to be looking north, north, is what we're saying. East basically. and west are relative to the sun's circle as it circles over the plane. So if you're talking about east and west, you have to follow the sun's path as it okay, circles so, over uh, the plane. So let me, use, let, me use clock, let me look at that map as a clock face. What we'd be looking at from Sydney is about 10, 10 o'clock, and what we'd be looking at from South Africa oh, would be about right. uh, 2 You'd be looking right? toward the south since you'd be looking away from the central north pole. Anywhere right. away from the central north pole would be towards south. That's exactly right. But here they are separated by about 90 degrees. Would we all agree on that? I, I roughly am. Um, I sure. have a quick so, question so about that. that. Seems, if the south pole... Fair. If the South Pole is the ring around the thing, if I'm looking towards the South Pole, which direction am I looking? That's, hang on, please let's not get onto that. It That's exactly the, the question we're asking. It would be a southern ring, not a pole or point. It would be a southern ring. Then why is there a southern pole? Can we not, can we not please, of please, ball. oh, for fuck's sake, people, please, Jesus, it's like herding cats with, with ADHD. Uh, can you just, everyone, just let him get to the end of this, please, Lale, yes, point. Brenda, I've been Lemon. With this for four oh, years, what is the, the point? Just get to the point. Yeah, I mean, really, dude, this is why it's so much simpler to just tell them how stupid they're being for denying this in the first place. Kimo, so go ahead. Happy with that 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 just get to the fucking point. Kimo, are you happy with that they're 90 degrees apart, so they shouldn't be showing the same thing circling due south of them, according to this map, but would be on a globe? Yeah, I mean, like I say, if you can show where on, uh, like I say, if you can show where these three observers in the south, um, it's not going to work on on a flat plane. You won't have observers oh. seeing these uh, these this pole on a flat plane. On a ball, you would. Sure, they would so. all look the same way. They would all look up at the same direction, and and that's not going to happen. You'll never be able to show that. See, okay, three observers from South Africa to Australia cannot see the South Celestial Pole. Why? Why are you time. taking out South America? I know South America is because most it will be in daytime. Like that would that would observed. expose the flat Earth model to be even more incorrect if you could show and it, it from and off, it can. South we would America just have well. to wait. 
we, we can, but chemo seems keen South, at no, South exactly Africa the is same time, it. whereas that would no, be... America, Listen, but you've got if, to use if all three continents, you have a few months of the year where you have an hour window every single day yes. to make this observation. Yes, but that's what we want. And that's what I'm saying. If you want to kill the flat Earth, like literally I'm kill it, the goalposts a bit. finish the flat Earth, you've got Wait, to I'm... show South America, South Africa, and Australia. Okay. All right. so an hour have... every okay. day? That's what Percent yeah. says. There. An hour every day. Get it done. Get all of you on the same line. Who together. said this? They're already, they're already changing the deal. So, where, hey, Globe, the hour Tyler, the could, could you show, show your working for that percentage? What's that? W was, it, was it you, Percentage, who was saying there's an hour every day where they're all... Yeah, there's up? about an hour, maybe even more, if you like, you know, because stars are visible during working. astronomical twilight. The, you know, depending on their illumination. So, yeah, sure. Could, and, and this is from, from like, that, you know, before the the summer solstice all the way to the the autumn equinox. So you have could like, you, show, you know, you a large part, a, a pretty large part of the year and you have a, like about an hour every day to make this observation. Done. Yeah, but you just need to get the people in, this, in the right uh, right location. So basically, Wait, I, just, if I this works at equinox, then thing. you got six months to do it. It, yes, but I just don't think that's true because they're separated by twelve hours. Yeah, I don't think so either. I don't think you're going to get all. Well, three I mean, you guys trust your your model long. and and timeanddate.com. Well, no, I don't not. trust your understanding of it. I don't think you've looked into well, this right. Why is it Your definition before you jump in. Simple, curve. man. Go, hop on timeanddate.com. Look out. It right. shows it, that it's exactly. night. Or... Exactly. Exactly. We're He's using talking a... about coastal coastal the the extremes of the coastlines. I I imagine in some. Are areas. you meaning from Perth? Because I'm not in Perth. We're doing it from Sydney. East Coast if you, of Australia. If you want to get Western Australia, South no, Africa, or Australia. anywhere in Africa, and the East Coast of South America, there is a window, but it's not what Bukunich is saying. I'm wondering why he's saying it is what it is well, what's the when window? it's not what he says. What is the window? It is what I'm saying. It only just grazes. If it's that, if it's that shadow map that was posted in the chat before then that's only touching the top of south america which is not um which is too close to the equator for this to be reasonable and it's only barely touching perth which is not where i am and i'm not going to be able to travel eight thousand or whatever it is six thousand kilometers to get there i think it's reason reasonable given the map that um chemo posted to show that they are 90 degrees apart on on his map um and we'd be seeing the same thing pointing at 10 o'clock and two o'clock on his map, which I think should be should be enough. But if it's not, that's fine. You know, it's it's up to him. I mean, it's it's his it's his flat plane that that would be being crushed by by his wording. So, which you know, that would be. I understand I why you want to make the burden insurmountable because that would be a very uncomfortable thing to do, a bold thing, an impressive. Demo, thing to do yes or no? I think he's already said no, hasn't he? Yeah, I've said that. He, what we're asking for on a flat plane. No, look, no, no, Timo, yes or no. What to what he said? No, 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 that's not. What yeah, to what he said. Yes no, or no? No, no. Okay. No. Nope. I thought that much. All right, that conversation's is over. Not to what Everybody he said. Home. What I said, yes. That's what he said. We agreed. He said, "I can do it." Of course, I can do it. And that's what he agreed. Now he's changing it. Flat Earth will never die. Yeah, you put. Yeah, good, you flat. pulled off a good little trick, Kimo. He didn't think about one of them being in darkness, and you did. You're really clever. Well <laughs> yeah, done. I was, I was more thinking uh, when he was saying at the same time. I was like, oh, at 10 p.m. at night or something, not at the same time. Yeah, it's an old <laughs> chestnut of theirs. This one, you know, it's an eggshell. Eggshell. What? What's your idea? What's so hard about it? You literally have about an hour every single day for like a third of the year to do this. You could show me you working on show that. that hour. Hour. Show when that. I go to timeanddate.com, I get, I get the different results. But percentage, you could get, get clouds in that hour. And you have yeah, to have people. Every single day for like a and third of the year. And you have to have people in very, very specific locations. And that's not convenient. Like, on that one, I can see South How is this South difficult for you? Yeah, there but the, if you South have the America observer, America. then it's not yeah, an there's issue. There's no, yeah, but. He's a retard. That's how it's. Dude, you're, you guys made the claim that it's possible to do. Now you're trying to shift, like, uh, the goalposts. Well, you are. It's didn't. pathetic. Don't you're an idiot, accurate. and you know you are. Well, the so, flat Earth. Well, first it was three think... locations. Now it's two loc three locations in between the two locations that were already agreed upon. Like, come Shut on. I want to. I want to see what he says. Matter, it does it? If, if it if it's impossible on a flat Earth, what does it matter? 
No, I want to see it possible on our model at Equinox. It's just yeah, it, that's that's. I would be. I would. I would happily go ahead and do it if 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 percentage if what you're saying is that all are in darkness at the same time. If Sydney, South, I want to show show, that. Australia. show some demonstration of what he's claiming. Right. I already showed it in the chat. Where you're doubting like, your own like model. Western Australia. Yeah, can I ask you where? I didn't deny a fucking in the chat. Thing. Look at look at the last thing I said. You don't say things in text. You write them. So, um, eggshells. What is your idea of uh, percent and chemo? Do you think they're flat earthers? Uh, yeah, I think I think they believe. Oh, they're fairly. You're an idiot then. You're an idiot. Well, that's a nice yeah. thing to say to somebody. Yeah, oh, no, they're not. They're not flat earthers, dude. Dude, they're not flat earthers. You don't know that. Yeah, I do. Prove it. They lie. Prove it. You're just guessing like everyone else. They lie. Stop being all arrogant about it. People who lie. <laughs> all right, are not honest, look, look so, at that picture yeah. there. Lael's posted. That's the one. Look at those three countries all in darkness together. What? At Lael is fun. I I see. I see. <laughs> The sun setting in Perth, which is where I'm not, and I see the sun having not yet risen at the southern tip of South America, which is where I'm talking about. Why are you talking about the southern tip? Why do you trust that's anything Lael says or posts? Well, that's pretty sufficient. I think the point is to get away from the equator and be like deep yeah, in, the be southern south south in the southern hey. hemisphere. Hey, if you're measuring the south. Yeah, okay, well, to be fair, even the southern tip is in. No, no. A Pocunage. Economical twilight at that point. So you still, still be Equinox. Visible. Equinox, cunt. He doesn't understand what that word means. He doesn't know what it means. What you posted point? solstice. Fucking June solstice, you nimwit. The yeah, from the solstice to down. the equinox, it's at nighttime. What's equinox? That, no, Go to the autumn know. equinox, you'll see it's still nighttime. It's not as big of a window. What is but it's still mean? nighttime. You still have like astronomical twilight, even during civil twilight. But the bright show, show equinox. Show equinox. This is I already so showed ridiculous. it. Where? Above the one when I showed solstice. You fucking retard. Well, here's here's here's. I don't question. have the entirety of your fucking post at my fingertips. You dick. Let well, do a quick search. Uh, big, so chemo. Chemo, I have a question Brenda, for you. The big questions, Brenda, cause uh, the big problems. Now, your friend, your colleague, there's no big Egg, question. Eggshell says, before this, is, this experiment, this is, and then he backtracks. Kindergarten. There's oh, no big but, questions here. Brenda, if you want to end the flat earth, you want to end this nonsense that you call nonsense, abide this observation, and flat earth cannot be. How can it work on a flat earth? Why What's don't you chemo? establish the flat Earth by providing this observation? How chemo. About it's interesting, that? yeah, that you haven't done. We're in the middle. Of, we're in the middle map. Earth, Jim. Yeah. We're in middle Earth. Then, then guys are on the proof. outer edge of the Earth. We, we, we can't even go there. Chemo. Is there a southern pole? Um, and that would infer southern hemisphere. And on a flat plane, there oh. is nowhere southern hemisphere. Do you, do you yeah, base your that. knowledge off of the assumption that it's flat, or do you base your knowledge on reality? Um, so well, we can observe water flat. For, so for example, because you're going to try and change anyway, the subject already. Before we move on. For example, yeah. for example, what you just said in response to Brenda yeah. was because of Southern Hemisphere on a flat Earth, then you gave an explanation. So you're making the assumption and you're basing your knowledge off of that. I don't have to make the assumption. There is a Southern Pole. Fuck the shape of the earth. There is a southern pole. Can you say that? Where is it? No, no, no. Can you say that? I don't care about the shape of the earth. There is a northern pole and a southern pole in the sky. Okay, well, where is Do it? Do you acknowledge that there is a southern pole? I've just asked you, where is it? See, this is how I know that you're not a flat earther. I don't make right claims, here. Brenda. I don't make claims unless I can verify it. Uh, it's well, either years of flat earth the percentage so, okay I'm not well sure about whatever that. i'm i'm com but um chemo there's a star that is named sigma octantis right okay. do you agree say so no not if i say so then what what do you mean then what 
not because you say so, then well, who says so? Well, here's the thing, Kimo. <laughs> I can see that one, but when I go when I go to find Polaris with my telescope, guess where I have to look? Through the floor. It's there, but I just can't see it. Yeah, but what about people in South Africa and um, South that same America thing. at the same time as yeah. you? At the yeah, same time same as thing. you? Yeah, they can't say Polaris either. You don't know that. Oh, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm talking about yeah, your... We do. Oh, yeah, yeah, we got know you. that. Got you, got you. We I mean... absolutely know that. Okay, I didn't mean that. I mean, you couldn't right. keep up with it. I bullshit. Didn't to look for yeah, it. Yeah, I didn't mean that. I'm talking about you can't see the same pole at the same time as people in South Africa. And South it doesn't America. matter. If I'm sorry, go ahead. People in Australia be able to see Polaris? Um, it doesn't matter if people different people can't see it at the same time the very fact that there is a southern pole of rotation refutes the flat earth no no because they see it, it at different it times as it goes around the yeah but that doesn't refute anything yes it does on the flat earth on the flat let's think Kimo, about let's think about this. Kimo you forget you forget Kimo I, I brought to 24 hours of the south pole 24 hours doesn't move the same above the same place. Look, this is how it all Why works. Why do they move? This is how it, it works. Look, Kimo, Kimo, do you have 24 hours of the North Pole? If not, then South is the, the real pole and the North isn't. Um, well, let me just explain this. Do you have three people seeing the North uh, Pole from three different locations? No, no, just let me explain this. Um, so what happened, why they won't show three observers is because first the Australians will see at that point, then it moves around to South Africa, then it moves around to South America, and then back around to Australia. Never at the same time. If that country. was true, we would so see it how, moving. We would see so, it moving into the sky in those locations, and no, we don't see it. But hold on, let me ask so, you. So well, how me, come, let me ask how you, come I have a video? Ask, hold on, Chiki, let me ask no, you. No, Kimo, Kimo, answer no, my why question. Why do you do don't this? Story. How do we have a video of uh, 24 on, hours of the South Pole if it moves? Right, Jem, you said... But um, I know what you said. Sorry, but... Chiki, we'll get back to yours, I promise. He'll right. just say it's fake or it's edited or some shit. Well, actually, Chikis is on the same point, so I don't know why it had to be made like that, but it's the same thing. It's not fucking moving. That right. has to be in writing. No, 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 no. Let me ask my questions, and then we can find out if that's true. Now, Jen. So, okay, go ahead. So, people in Australia see this point, yeah? The southern point, yeah? It's a star. Yeah, yeah, yes. yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. So, and then... Then people in South Africa see it. Yes. Hmm? No, not then. No, what do you mean it. then? Do people they in also South, do see people, that. Do people in that South would be a better way to say it. No, no, no. They, they no. see it at the same time. No. Any of those two, any of those two locations can see it at the same time. Any, any. Okay. Two. Well, if you're saying then, then we could just have those two locations, right, Kimo? Okay. If you're so, saying okay, you see it okay. The same so hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Also, looking in the same direction, south. So after Australia and South uh, Africa, this point. After that, then South America see it, right? After that. Yes. Um, Chronologically, through the day, as night moves across the earth, yes. Right, so there you go. One after another. Never at the same oh, time. That right, shows you that you're not... Right, still. But the pole itself doesn't move across the sky, the sky chemo, we've and you would need it, it to for we've that just, to be happening, we've wouldn't just, you? We've just Circles proven it, Jess. We've just proven it. No, just so, proved it. so chemo, no, the, the best proof for no, disproving what your claim is is oh. star trails. You can't have star trails if the entire if the pole Gem, is moving. Forget about all of that. Forget all of that, Jem. But listen, hold on. You haven't proven it. All you've proven is that it's night time in different places in the world at different times, and when it's night time, we can see the stars doesn't mean that they're not there does it and you're claiming that that though that this pole point polar point is is sweeping into view right 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 we don't that's... see that it's in one place no we do look you're saying we don't see that that's what we're asking to show that it's not doing that it's not i told, I no, told you we do chemo no, no, no. No, no, no. no gem that's what 24 
hours. Look, that's the point of this. If you is it... don't get a longer See, day, you, you know, you know, hours. you won't let me talk because you know exactly what we're saying. That those stars go across. If if at the same time it wouldn't they, go across. But... But his video shows that that's not happening. And we know that that's not happening because that doesn't happen. No, we've never seen the stars at the same time all at once. We see them one after another. One after another. Australia no, first. No, no. So if I just got South Africa and Australia, that would disprove that, right, Kimo? No, 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 no. You've you wouldn't, got to you show wouldn't need to Yes, it, it, would. Well. it would. No, it yes, wouldn't. would. No, it yes, would. Yes, it would. No, it yes, wouldn't. It would. no, it wouldn't. Okay, because it could see, adjust what you said. So, he so he... it would... So it could it could maintain both being no, true. We've never at the same said time. two points. We said three points. So you, you yes, can do two, two at a time. Like a, well, but what you point. just said is incompatible Make with like two a, points. You, like you see it in one web. place, then you see it in another. Like a week. So do you want to adjust what you check, said? Check timeanddate.com. You can get it in Brazil. Chemo's claim now. Chemo's claim is mm -hmm. that this pole moves around. Right. That should, that'd be really easy. Can we... All you need to do is point a, a telescope at the sky in one of these locations, you... and that will be visible. How do you explain then? How do you explain then South Af uh, South America stars after those two? Um, uh, Here, because it's here's not the... in Brazil. You can see it at the same hey, time. Kick them, light. Kick them, jump. Kick yeah. them. Oh no, I should for that. Because Kimo, it's here, night time. Hang on. It's because it's night time afterwards, Chemo, and we can't see stars during the day. No, I'm not Chemo, having... the no. same phenomena happens in the northern hemisphere, Goodness which is say, why if you, you pick three time. locations in the northern hemisphere in the same orientation as the southern, you're going to have the same phenomena where you're going to see stars in America when you don't see stars in the daytime in somewhere in the northern hemisphere. It's the exact right. same phenomena, uh, but you would never claim that the northern hemisphere moves across the sky. No, you would no, never no, claim no, that. No, no, no. This is I'm a very sorry. I, I, I keep on, you keep on omitting this. See, you you can't see it in talk. South America. You can see it in Brazil or the easternmost side of South America, simultaneous with South Africa and Australia. No, again, I'm not hearing the model. I'm not interested in your model or what's supposed to. What we're talking about is re reality now in reality no again, again the reality is you don't know what the fuck nighttime again, is or how it works no it doesn't matter and in reality that the southern the southern celestial pole does not move across the sky no, it well, let doesn't me explain well, let me there's explain. no evidence ever that it does no, again if you're saying it does you need to establish no, that this cannot happen yes like yes this. yes no 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 now, the very well, purpose. Yes, 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 yes. No, but look. I'd love to no, see the, no, the no. pole. I'd love to see a pole rise from the all horizon right. instead. No, of look, let, let him respond. Let him respond because right, we have you. all had a little Thank dig, you, haven't we? So the very purpose of this demonstration, observation, is to show that this doesn't happen. Because if you can show yeah. that all these observers at the same time can see this, it would prove that the the, the stars are not going from Australia to South America. South Africa, I mean, from South Africa to, you know, all the way around. That's the purpose of this experiment. Now, you're just saying, well, we're going by the mm. model. It stays in one place. There's no evidence. There's no proof, any of this, until Kimo. we have three observers in one place looking at the, at the same Why thing. do you need yeah. three? One Why camera one in one location, location shows this. That's how you get the fucking star trails to begin with. No, not, it's no, stationary. No, no, not by any of that. Right. Yes, Lyle, you can. Sorry, go ahead. Go ahead, Kev, sorry. Okay, so, Chemo, here's my question for you. You place someone at nighttime <sighs> looking due north in southern, southeastern Australia. Ask them to see if they can see the Big Dipper. No, again, Chris, just stick to the one right. top. I no, want no. and Chemo locked that in their respective homes that is what I want. with Max. Double Max. <laughs> Well, tied look, to each of them um, um, we're and they're not allowed to leave the residence I'm ending now a little bit you are you going to COVID test them? you can talk about the model if you want oh, we'll I'm not talking about the model I'm just talking about someone standing in southeastern Australia are you going to anal probe them? I'm and, talking uh, about someone sure me will do that and uh, <laughs> what's his name? eggshells Egg promise me promise South me now South just like by I promise me at night looking due north with the telescope and see if they can see any part of the Big Dipper. They should be able to on a flat Earth. No, none of that works. We're trying Thank to, you, you guys, I'm trying to work with you guys, exactly. remember. It doesn't work because the Earth is not flat. Trying to work well, with well, you guys. Well, you're answering that now we can't. You guys want to end the flat Earth or not? You don't need three, you need one.
Do you want your um, the next generation to be taught flat Earth or what you say is the truth about the globe? Do you want this or not? Okay, I've got a, I've got a different. What do you want, Kimo? What do you want? You could establish the flat Earth to be, uh, or at least establish some aspect of the flat Earth to be true with this. So why aren't you doing it? We've done it. We're doing it. We're already showing people the Earth on the globe. But if we had the evidence, no, 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 no. This specific thing, which is that the southern celestial pole moves across the sky. Uh, yeah, that would be pretty monumental, actually. All the stars move around the northern star, northern point. I, I mean, I don't, I don't know. I would call it a pole if it was moving across the sky, but well, it's a stripper yeah. pole, shaking its booty. <laughs> I, I don't know how we would have a southern pole if what Kimo said is true. Is that all yeah. the stars rotate around the northern pole? We'd only have one pole. Oh, we have two. So yeah, we'd have one pole and this big fanning out. Um, so what about this then, Kimo? If I and Sydney did it, and I was recording it at the same time as somebody in South Africa, and then kept the camera going, but the sun's going to come up, right? And then as the sun starts to go dark, I still had that person in South a South um, America. So showing the person in the middle would be able to show that it hasn't moved from their perspective as it was sort of handed off from day to night between Australia and South Africa. It'd be South something, America. it'd be something, yeah, but it's not what we're asking for, but it'd be something, yeah, if you can just uh, validate that it's in one place, not moving, yeah, that'd be good. No, I'd be mostly Star interested Trails with you. Do that. Not, not, Does Star not Trails do that, dude, already? No, 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 Star Trails don't do that. Well, would, 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 so would, they would, don't do would, that? Would, somebody that a, correct that me if I'm wrong. Would so what you're saying from... now is that it stays in position for the night time at one location and then moves quickly Jumps. to the next location. It's like I don't know. I don't horror. know what it does. Oh, it's fuck, I'm late for South movie. Africa. Got to go. Again, no claims. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It stays, stays totally still while you're watching it, and then it's like, quick, the lights are out. Let's go. No claims. <laughs> being... What are you saying is the southern pole is just a bunch of fucking cockroaches? No claims are being no, I made. I want to know how it moves. I want to know how it moves eleven thousand five hundred kilometers, so the person in South Africa can see it while I stop seeing it. No, you still see it. No, South Africa and Australia still see it at the same time. Kimo doesn't agree with he that. Cannot but he cannot see it in South it, America, so South really. Africa, and Australia at the same time. Impossible. Uh, yeah, you You're want to put than money a bag of bees, Kimo. Well, let's get it done. This is actually. I, I, I'm trying. I'm trying. Hey, come on, guys. I, 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 I've asserted that you can see it in all three continents. Exactly. Get it done. Your man said he can do it. We're waiting oh, for we it. We already know that. Yeah. But... Moyo, that isn't helping. No, Moyo, see, Jem, you keep you keep <laughs> doing this, Jem. Oh, I see, I see. Oh, I you see. see, there you okay. go, there you go. You see, this is the point. Get it done, um, X Moyo, and let's finish the flat Earth tonight, tomorrow, whenever you have. The sooner you get it done, the sooner oh, the flat Jesus Earth is all over. Jesus Christ! Flat Earth is finished. Has been. It's been no, done. It's not until Bio does his own mass right. experiment, and until Nathan, Nathan, the, Nathan stabbed it in the heart with a duck suit. No, look, that, that was, was that was awesome. Funny. That was so awesome. Look, Flat Earth, yeah, is the thing. this is the year for you guys. You know what to do. 2021, you know what to do. Why is Chemo controlling the conversation? Just, be going to bed soon. Just wrapping it up. Worry. Yeah, just wrapping it up. That, uh, we've got He's going to get his warm milk in a little bit. We've got two experiments so could on you, the table. Could you tell me then, Chemo, mm -hmm. could you tell me then why, given you, you assert that it cannot be viewed from South Africa and Australia at the same time, why it requires this one that we know to be in daylight? Like, why would that be a requirement for this, this experiment? He, do it all you like. We know the stipulations, three locations, not just the two. But you understand the question I just asked you, do you? Yeah, but do I'm you, not asking not? about that. That couldn't that might be Oh, fine. you don't want to answer that question. Might be uh, close Why? enough That's to do it. You might be close mm -hmm. enough to do it. That's fine. Might work. On this flat map, it looks like it could be possible, but not from South uh, America. Due south impossible. from Australia and due south from South Africa could show the same cluster of stars circling due south of us, even though it's ninety degrees opposite. Well, I'm looking at this That's map. Interesting. I'm looking at the map. Very here. interesting. Look at the map here, and it, it may be possible. To okay, so what? So, all right. So looking at that map, what about what about if we flip it and we go, we give up South Africa and we go South America and Sydney? How's that? Because that's one or close to 180 degrees, isn't it? South America and Sydney. You're looking at South uh, South America, Australia, you, South Australia, South America. You're looking in the opposite direction. So that would be that would be that would satisfy your requirements. Hey, uh, Kimo, we can still why get a third observer just in yeah. between them. Anyway, look, this is it. I'm done now. Like yes, Jem yes says. or no, Kimo? Would that would that satisfy you or no? Not, not. Again, we've given you the rules. 
my friend. I mean, this has been the same rules for many, many years now. And again, you fought just like years ago. So, do you want to pop- explain to me why it wouldn't why it wouldn't satisfy them? Well, I mean, I would have a go. Let's see what you can do. It's one hundred and eighty degrees opposed on that map you you posted, right? Well, just have a go. Yeah, have a have a go on it. Yeah, have a go. No, but I'm asking why why it wouldn't satisfy you because that's an interesting because, question because to me. Because we need a three. We need a three. So we could still get a third observer. It would just need to be between the two, but. Yeah, yeah, it would, yeah. It would absolutely throw that map out the window, wouldn't it? So why wouldn't you accept it? Um, because that's not what we put forward. Because he doesn't understand it. No, no I, I think, think I think he, he does understand, understand it. it. He, knows, hold on, hold on, hold on. he understands it very well. I mean, Kimo, that's not what we put forward. Sure, we could put it forward, though, couldn't we? So, so my my question is not what did we put forward. My question is what what about that would be so compatible with your current model that it wouldn't be a valid test or would it be a valid test because it's got that falsification we talked about the other day right if i didn't see that that would falsify my claim and therefore prove it wrong um again it's it's i mean i have to think i mean that's not what we claim and prove it wrong i know it's not what we put forward but that's not the question i'm asking the question is why will you not put it forward now because let's focus on what we put forward get that done Right. It seems, seems like you're kind of, I mean, sure. I mean, it's up to you what you what you want to agree with because it's your, like, I can understand it's a it's a model that you hold quite dear. It's quite important to you. Um, well, I tell you so what, I'm not sure. I'm not sure it would satisfy the entire flat Earth community. We're looking to satisfy satisfy no, I'm just everybody. To satisfy you. Yeah, but to again, satisfy you. Yeah, again, for I don't me, know if this... for me, it that's a mistake be... right there. For me, um, you know, I mean, it's questionable because uh, we we need. To... We could still have three give you a great answer. Be between South um South America and Australia, so we could get somebody from the islands. I'm just asking, what, why, why that, or would that be enough to satisfy you? Because I know it's not what we agreed originally, but but it still seems that that observation would be utterly incompatible with your map. So, so let's, the let's, only let's, reason let's I just, think uh, of look, it is late. That, that and would be it is late. I mean, we can carry on in the morning, possibly. But let's um, stick to our agreement. You're going to show. You said I can call three observers same time, it make seems observation. A little bit like you're stuck on one that you know to be um, wrong. To yeah. to be problematic because given the day night cycle that we all agree. Yeah, because percent's already giving you the details. Yes. It works. It gives you the right, windows of opportunity. details that require me to go to Perth. But the not, windows of opportunity. It's worse than that. Somebody's got to go to some who knows where in South America. That was his claim, well, Jim. Yeah. His claim. So, look. So, so, so is there a reason? Do you want to share? Or is there a reason why you wouldn't? Maybe talk to David. David can help you. Uh, percent is here. Is Jeremy kind here? of feels like you're weaseling. I don't know yeah, if okay. anybody else is getting that impression. It kind of feels like you're trying to trying to wriggle. I'm, I'm no, it's here. very late. You always catch when it's late. Yep. We've got oh, Jankers okay. here. Right. Yeah, we're fair enough. That's okay. If you, look, if you don't want yeah. to, that's, that's fine. Because I understand. Jankers here. Jankers, you, you understand the, the, the position. Yeah. yeah. No, I wanted to. I wanted to ask, uh, ask Jem some. Jem, uh, why I, do you think the Earth is I flat again? Is, is I don't think the Earth is flat. Me and Chemo. I know the Earth is spherical. Me and Chemo feel your pain. I'll be here, We're going to help you work through it. We was that really his people, question? It we do have some people that uh, have the inability, inability to think. Uh, one like Jim, he he is he's going to be very hard to break. Emo, is that your map of the flutter? <laughs> I am David. I am going to be very hard to break. Yeah, it's that was like, you know, you, you got you got to think degrees. about it. Like Jim, if these guys, they're, they're, they're like alcoholics of the globe. Okay. <laughs> Can Buenos Aires, Argentina, so- a common known place. Cape Town, South Africa. That map makes the UK look really tiny. Oh, I got a, I got a new, I got a new, I got a new word. Globe, be able to see globe card attic. The, globe the card attic. Effort. I like it. Kimo, are you there? Chemo's done talking. Do, can I help you? No, Dave, you can't help anyone. We're me and Chemo are here to help you guys. Uh, it's we, Chemo and I. 
Kimo and I are here to help your help you guys. That's what. What do you think we're here so for? So it's Joe Biden and Dave to help. Oh, well done, David. Well done for making an effort to be grammatically perfect. Why isn't Dallas Dave frozen <laughs> and his water turned off? I don't think he really lives in Dallas. Okay, so David, hey, man, you, I, I, you guys ought to know night. that I'm a prepper. You, you guys ought to know I'm a prepper and have got <laughs> been prepped just for just for this occasion. I'm a Thank prepper now. Yeah, I haven't missed a meal. We've been eating no, steaks over here. Prepared. There's nothing wrong with being prepared. Um, so How many David, days of pastries do you have saved up, Jim? <laughs> <laughs> My freezer is absolutely jacked.